as you can see this thing is very 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 dirty on the outside uh, just starting we started with the rag and then I had to grab a scrub brush because it's so bad but making progress <laughs> afternoon everyone today what we're going to do is we're going to take this canoe that we were given and we are going to restore it uh, we will not finish in one day but we will take a couple days and restore it and I've got the boys here with me today and they're gonna help first step we're gonna do is we're gonna wash it uh, and that's what we're about to do now and then after that we're gonna put some cleaner on it and get it clean for y'all but this thing is in good shape but very very dirty uh, inside and out so we are going to first just wash all this stuff from it it's been sitting outside for as far as I know about six years uh, so that is our first step I had a number on it at one point. We got step one done, got it washed the best we could by hand already looking so much better so now i'm about to go grab uh, some aluminum cleaner that i got and we're gonna spray it down try to get some of these tough spots uh, and get it that much more clean for y'all a little of this aluminum cleaner on there to try to get the tough spots out uh, i got my safety gloves on just in case and hopefully it's supposed to make it like new <laughs> Got the first coat done and you can see an obvious difference on one side compared to the other. I've got a few tough spots so I'm going to hit again on here. i uh, try to get as clean as possible before I start uh, shining it. The only thing it didn't take off was, looks to be some red paint and some black paint on here. Um, but I'm hoping maybe when I go to Buffett I can get that pulled out. Got the first coat cleaned off with the cleaner. Now, gonna let it dry. And once it dries, we're gonna start polishing it and try to bring this thing to a shine so good that you can shave in it. Good catch. I know when you get tired, okay? Alright, so we've got 
the first two steps done we cleaned it really really well and now we have shined it and it is looking like a totally different canoe it almost looks like an airstream it's so shiny uh, so our next step is we're going to wash her really good make sure we get all the residue off of her and then we're going to flip her over and start working on getting the inside cleaned up and uh, getting it look like uh, so we can use it to go and do a little bit of fishing in it and uh, hopefully be the talk of the lake with how shiny this thing is. The next thing I am going to do is I taped off the sides in yellow and right under the lip I'm going to paint it blue uh, and make me a pinstripe that matches the blue on the outside just to kind of give it that old retro look. So that's uh, the next step in the process. I'm about to do the part that I'm looking forward to the most. Uh, I'm going to take this Ziz wheel and I am going to take it and do designs in this. I say designs, just be circulars in this and all the way down the edges and on the seats. Um, I, I really can't wait to see how this turns out. Uh, That's the part I'm about to start now and look forward to the most. <laughs> marks it's kind of hard to pick up but you can see it really good in the sun I just kind of swirled everything up on the top that i'm not going to paint or anything i'm going to do here a wax coat in a minute to help preserve it but the boys helped me do a little bit of it up here uh, they kind of got tired of holding but hey i think it's pretty unique and looks awesome so now i'm about to tape it off clean it out and do the last coat of gray paint on the inside and this this girl will be all done Thank you for joining us on this adventure of redoing the canoe we just finished up i uh, had to flip it over because it's starting to rain over here in georgia uh, we got a tropical storm coming through of all things but uh, we had a great time doing it looking forward to using it in the future uh, finney helped me do a lot of things on it so we and liam is at school right now so we aren't able to get him in the video and it's about to start really really raining and uh we appreciate y'all watching thank you very much bye